to be having a Mississippi pot roast I'm gonna cook in my crock pot and just some regular taco meat so I can have like a taco salad let's get this Mississippi pot roast in the crock pot so right here I have a two pound boneless chuck roast I'm just gonna add this to the crock pot plop <laughs> To the pot roast I'm just gonna season it with a little bit of complete seasoning on top of that I'm gonna add the ranch packet a full pack you could season this with salt and pepper if you would like but I just use the complete seasoning season it to your liking I'm going to add some Greek peppers, just like five of them and a little bit of um, the juice, a stick of Kerrygold butter, and right here I have some um, azul. I had rip the packet open but you get the picture some azul and I only added um a half a teaspoon of that or maybe not teaspoon yeah a full teaspoon a full teaspoon of the azul and one fourth teaspoon of xanthan gum the second meal for my meal prep this week is going to be easy simple five minute taco meat which you can make taco bowls the taco seasoning that i use for my ground beef is the taco bell seasoning and the ground beef that i use is the 75 25 ground beef and you're just simply going to follow the, the directions on the back of the packet right here as you can see i added some water because that's what the back of the packet called for <laughs> Just gonna mix all that together and then voila, you have your taco meat, ground beef. So you can make a taco bowl, just tasting it right here. So that's what I'm gonna show you how I do my taco bowl. I didn't have any lettuce, so I made the bowl without lettuce, just meat, cheese. And a dollop, do a dollop of daisy, do a dollop of daisy, and a dollop of sour cream. And that is my simple taco bowl. You can also use tortillas, but... I did and these are the low carb ones that I use and per tortilla you have uh, five grams of carbs so that is not bad so to make this whole keto meal keto friendly instead of using rice I'm going to use cauliflower rice the bad cauliflower didn't take two to three minutes to cook and I also seasoned the cauliflower with a little bit of salt and black pepper for taste So this is the outcome of the pot roast, the Mississippi pot roast. As you can see, I read it, there is no gravy on this, like that xanthan gum did wonders. And as you pick through it, you can take out the stems. Y'all, my mouth is watering. This it smells so good. It tastes 
2ปันนามะนาวThe chorizo comes like this, and you have to take it out of this um, wrap. Who is Mexican? Told me how to do the chorizo. Let me just cut it like this. And then that just comes off. 